prayer is not a ritual. It's not tradition. It's not formality. Prayer is serious business. And if you are in doubt, ask Uhuru Kenyatta. <laughs> and myself. Prayer is serious business. First, when we went to State House for the first time after we won the election, we accompanied His Excellency the President to State House. So we, when we arrived there, we went to the office, inside the office where a long time we used, we used to, be, to go and see Nyayo inside. <laughs> and again, we went to see Kibaki when he was there. So when we entered inside, the, the president told me, my friend, please pray first, let us pray. <laughs> so, So, so I prayed. <laughs> and then uh, we had a chat, and then we came outside. So, and then another eight of hours. I don't want to mention his name because he has applied for a job. <laughs> it, <laughs> it might be used against him. <laughs> so we came outside there when we were having a chat. So this gentleman told us, now, you guys, supposing somebody shows up here and says, uh, sorry, gentlemen, there was a small mistake. <laughs> <laughs> you are not supposed to be the ones who are supposed to be. <laughs> We had decided with the president that because God, you know, really has done this for our country. We've had peaceful elections and God has been gracious to us as a nation. And we must give him all the glory. We said we are going to kneel down so that we are prayed for. But we didn't know how to tell now this, all these people, sorry, all these people. And uh, the most difficult person was the uh, chief of defense forces. <laughs> we didn't know now, how do we tell this man we are going to kneel down? <laughs> so the president told me, just leave it. We just tell the pastor to come and announce. <laughs> <clears throat> so, so when that time arrived and uh, we were supposed to kneel down, I saw the eyes of the chief of defense forces. <laughs> and he was not amused. And uh, he told me, because we were running there, there is no way the commander-in-chief is going to kneel down. The soldiers are standing there. <laughs> but you know, the, the president told him, uh, uh, CDF just uh, stepped back and we knelt down and we were prayed for but uh, after a day I met the CDF and he told me his wife told him if there was the ceremony of inauguration forget about anything else that happened the kneeling down was the event.
as we go forward beyond our political divide, beyond the race, the races and communities we come from. It is our desire that God puts us together, wells us together, brings us together so that we can work together for the glory of God and for the success of our country so that we can have one united, prosperous nation. Thank <clears throat> you.